you can call me Cliff. So, today, I am going to show you, not this, really, this, this is just an OR gate with just repeaters and uh, solid blocks. No, that's easy. I'm going to show you this. This is a NOT gate with only repeaters and solid blocks and one redstone lamp at the end as an output and one uh, lever here as the input. So, as you can see, uh, if I turn it off, the output turns on, and then when I turn it on, the output turns off. And this is completely pointless because you could just use a torch to do it, but it's cool because I just used repeaters and solid blocks, and that's not the easiest thing to do. So, how it works is, as you can see, when it's on, all of these lines are off. When it turns off, this little bit right here works as a falling edge detector, outputting a pulse into here. This pulse goes into this clock right here, and three of the outputs of the clock combine in this big OR gate right here to activate the output because at least one of the three is always on at any time due to how I set up this clock. Then when I turn it back on, not does it not only does it reset this, but it also sends a signal out around here and locks this repeater in the clock. However, it, can, it will only ever lock it in the off state because this line coming off of the clock will lock this repeater whenever this repeater is on. So it can only lock the repeater when that repeater is off. That's about it. Thanks for watching, and stay crafty.